the magician. This is a horror story, but it is a true one, as you will know when I have done. Magicians are not believed in nowadays, but they still exist. And I will tell you about one whom you can all employ after reading my story. A fever being of earth, endowed with the spirit and the power of which I speak, once exclaimed, I wish, and he wished to see a city built, to see forests and fields, streams, tiny lakes, and many other wonderful things in a desolate country. This power was put into force in a thousand directions and soon dwellings arose. Since once barren west became endless beauty, human creatures and dumb animals dissolved, and the abundance of all good things brought harmony in every home, and there was no enemy. For this power blessed all alike. I saw this power and its might and beauty, and it was not from beneath, it was from above. It was a principle that even exalted beings recognize, honor, and employ. Idleness, want, and misery had banished, and the thoughts of a human creatures had time to saw to love their themes that still had in them the higher demands of this mighty power. Shall I tell you the secret? That you also may exercise this magical gift? The lowliest hearts and hands may build it and help to adorn the earth. Help to enable and bless each fellow creatures. The name of this magical power is prayerful labor.